All right, Coach Burnett, huge conference win. Two top 10 teams in Ohio. Mayfield, Larry Pioneers. Oh, nice hat, by the way. Oh, thanks, Tribe. Uh, talk about the duel, man. You had you had some guys come up big for you. Uh, yeah. Um, well, you know, our three guys up top at 89, 215 and heavy did a fantastic job. I mean, um, you know, our 89 potter, his technique wasn't so good uh, uh, when he was uh, with that little head hunter. Um, and he got caught, put on his back. But, you know, to come back 5-1 from 5-1 from, from and to beat a quality guy, I mean, that kid's a good kid that he wrestled. So, uh, I mean, that's a good win for him, you know. And, and, and uh, of course, our 215, you know, he wrestles Hayes. And Hayes is, uh, Hayes is just really tough. He's really solid. And, uh, you know, that, that's, a, that's a great win for Nellis. And, you know, they'll see each other again, obviously. They're, They're the two, three team. guys behind scales probably in Ohio. Uh, I, I don't know. I'm not sure where our, our, our Nellie's rated right now. Um, but we're going to see him again at the conference, and we're going to see him again at the, you know what I mean, at, at, at the uh, further along the, the road. You know what I mean? So uh, it's, it's not over by any stretch. You know, our, our guys are going to have to keep working at it. And, uh, you know, our heavyweight lost to uh, Dasher last year. Dasher's a good wrestler. And, you know, going into that match... Um, you know, and I think he got stuck. I think I think we got stuck last year by, by Dasher. And, you know, you're up by five, and you, your, your heavyweight wants to win, and, and you know, but you know, well, if he doesn't get pinned, we're okay. And you know, that's kind of a nail biter because the kid's got a lot of pride. So you want him to go after it, but you also want him to wrestle smart, and that's exactly what he did. And that's a really good thing to see. Um, and our, our forty pounder, you know, Hebel, uh, Jake has has come a long way. I, I was saying during his match, literally. Walking and chewing gum was difficult for him two years ago. What, what have you guys done in the literary program to bring a kid like Jake Hibble along? I don't, I don't know if it's what, what we've done. I, I know our, our, our coaches, you know, Gillespie has spent a lot of time with Jacob. Um, and, and Jacob, I, I, I don't know if he's satisfied with where he's at right now. I hope he's not. You know, he's got 14 wins this year. Um, he, he's come a long way. He's spent a lot of time in the offseason working at it. And he knows that he has a ways to go. So I'm hoping... I'm hoping that he's not satisfied. Satisfied, but you know, tonight is, is a really good win for, for Jacob and something to build on for, for certain. Okay, you guys did not have Coleman. They, they did not have Coleman in the lineup. Uh, Goins actually beat him at the Brexville. You get the forfeit. Do you think that affected their performance? You probably did. I mean, when you're missing a good guy, um, absolutely. You know, you you, you want to have your guy in there battling, and, and uh, you know, he wasn't there, and, and that's uh, that makes it tough. You know, he, you know if. If they wrestle and Goins, if Goins wins, you know what I mean, that, that knocks three points uh, off of our score if, if we just get a decision. Um, you know, if, and if, of course Coleman could win. Uh, their match at Brexel was very tough. So, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm certain that that, that that hurt them. Okay, you guys are in an extremely deep Division One Northeast Ohio. Okay, the, the, right now it's Wadsworth, Perry, Eds running for that title. And then you got a host of... Four, five, six, well, seven. Braxville, Braxville uh, you guys. Uh, obviously, Mayfield. Okay, and you know, where do you guys see yourself finishing at the Ohio State tournament this year, Coach? That depends. Um, you know, a lot of our kids have worked very hard, and, and are they going to turn the corner? And that's that's the big thing at, at, at this time of the year in, in, in our sport. I mean, you you need to make the adjustments as the season goes along. And yeah, your summer work obviously helps out, or we wouldn't be doing it in the summer, but. You have to make your adjustments during the season. You have to do the little things right. You got to manage your weight. You you have to manage your time. These are the things that our guys are going to need to do if they want to finish out the season strong. And um, if they do it, they have an excellent shot at doing something. If they don't, uh, you know there, there might be some hearts that are broken. Okay, coach, you got anything else for me? No, it was just a good win. It's good to see you again, obviously, and. Uh, you know, best of luck. Best of luck to everybody out there, man. Everybody stay healthy and get after it. All right, Coach Burnett. Good luck and uh, go Pioneers. Right on.